Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for the love and support. You know, with us going through all these crazy changes, it's good to be able to have an open, you know, forum for a community where we all can just relax and no judgment and go ahead and just tell what's on our minds and you know not have anybody judge us so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming our way coming your way as well <laughs> i was like coming our way well yeah it is all coming our way um and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Also, if you are comfortable enough, please drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video. Or you're just up, tell me about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. Also, if... Um, you feel like the video has been very informative to you it just gave you you know some good vibes that you would love to share with the loved one or friend or even you know a fellow impact they're going through some certain you know going through some really hard times right now needs validation and confirmation you know please go ahead and share and while you're at it give me a thumbs up and like and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit and thank you once again for stopping by my channel and giving me so much love and support it's greatly appreciated i love y'all from the bottom of my heart and i hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and today the meditation music i'm listening to is eight hertz deep lucid dreaming uh, music, fast, uh, lucid dreaming, astral projection, 432 hertz, music, binarial beats. I love binarial beats meditation music. Um, and I will post that link in the description box below. And my video that I'm doing, uh, today, um, is basically talking about the 5D. You know, uh, letting you know the signs of you, uh, being in the 5D. Like, I am right now in the 5D. It's just like, it feels so, I've never took acid before. I've never took anything except weed, you know, and it's just really crazy, but it just has you feeling like you're in a different astral plane. I don't know if it's like contributing towards the meditation I'm using, but I was even talking to my friend earlier. I said, everything is so sensitive. Like, it's like, it makes you feel euphoric, like you, you're you on something, like some kind of muscle relaxer or something. I wish I had a muscle relaxer because my dad on joints is killing me right now. But it is just like seeing everything for what it's worth, you know. Everything is so beautiful. Um, seeing how everything is straight connected. I, I mean, it feels magical that you know, we all connect in some kind of way, you know, where it just seems like I can talk to, talk about a video and next thing you know, you're like, Rosalind, I'm having ringing of the ears or even ones because there, I got a lot of subscribers that hits me up on Facebook and I always tell people, you know, if you want to talk to me on one-on-one, -on -one, I just have certain times between 9.30, well, 10, 10 o'clock in the morning till you know, 1030 at night, I try to get, you know, talk to people, you know, they, they can talk to me one-on-one -on -one if they don't feel like talking about their issues or concerns or questions out on public. And I always say, oh, there's no problem because not everybody's comfortable like that. But I always let them know everything is in confidence. You know, I help you out as best way as I can. You know, just look me up under my name on Facebook Messenger, you know, let me know, hey, I'm a YouTube fan or I'm a Hayoka or whatever. And, you know, we can connect that way. But it's just like I've been connecting with people and it's just like they're talking about the ringing of the ears. You know, it feels like you're on going vertigo. A lot of people have been getting sick lately where it feels like you're having the flu. You're not really motivated. I mean, it's just going through all these things because, I mean, today I was going through so much because I was channeling my friend uh, in her situation. She's going through right now. I just don't like talking about people's business like that, but it's like prime example. Um, going through certain situations and I'm feeling every emotion and I'm just like you know even felt like stigmata she was going through something and her energy is so powerful I know everything she's going through at that time I'm like oh my god my you know my chest hurts feels like I got a dagger going from one end to the next and I'm just like wait a minute that's the heart chakra and it's like you know the clavicle and all this stuff is just you know it's just too much 
and it was like, I wasn't feeling like this until I got on the phone with her. And then it's just like, as soon as I got off the phone with her, it was like the residue was still there because it felt like I had like a brain freeze. I was eating a lot of ice cream and you already know what brain freeze <laughs> feel like if you eat ice cream. That mess is not no joke. You're like, ah! You know, so it was like the penal gland was just acting all up. It was on 20. You know, I was just like, gosh, it went zero to 10,000 real quick. Like, I'm just like, what is going on? You know, hearing any and everything, being able to, it feel like euphoric. I mean, you're just connected with everything. You're seeing everything, not letting anything from the 3D materialistic world get at you. Like I was telling her about my situation with YouTube, you know, it seems like every time I add a video and upload towards y'all, they take a subscriber away. And I'm just noticing that's been going on for a while because it's just like I'm looking like, you know, by the time right now, I should have almost close to 3,000 subscribers. But it just seems like every time I have upload a video, because I do between, you know, five or six videos a day, maybe eight. But there are sometimes they, you know, the gap is so long it takes forever for them to upload. Like if it's a 15 minute video, I guarantee you it takes about three or four hours for it to upload. I'm like, God, dog, you know. But they all, it's crazy because YouTube will ask you for a survey, but they want to ask you their certain questions. They won't give you that, that form for you to complain about the things that they got going on, but you know how folks can be at times. But, you know, it wasn't like things I was really bothered about. Well, I'll put my attention out there, but I was just like, it really didn't bother me like it would have, you know, before. Like, I would keep going at it. Like, I can mention it to y'all because I'm bringing this to a where, like, if, you, if you've been trying to give me a thumbs up, and the dislikes, let me know, you know, because I know there's a lot of times I have a lot more dislikes. I mean, not dislikes, but a lot of thumbs up than, you know, sometimes on other videos. I'm like, wow, what's going on? So, and it just didn't bother me because I already know the more that, you know, the materialistic world is trying to take away from me. You know, because some people, you know, they want to be competitive, you know, especially with YouTube. It just seemed like they'd be having it out for certain people and stuff like that. So I'm like, it is what it is, because I feel like anything that's being taken out of my life is about to add on to something better anyway. But any other time, it would have really just, you know, the 3D world really would get at me. And I'm just like, no, it just feels like a balance. Like I had to go through this because even though they're trying to do this and that to me, because it seems like anytime they take one away from me, another one done, you know, two more done sit up here and subscribe to me. I was like, universe got my back on that. That's what I'm talking about. But it's just like, I'm just so laid back. I feel like a surfer dude. <laughs> you know, I was like, no worries, man. You know, and I'm just like, wow. And my friend was like, girl, you are all up in the 5D. You don't even realize it. And it's like, I've been here before, but it's like, you know, it'll be like a touch and go. It was like, you know, 3D and then up to, you know, 5D. Because when you're up in 5D, you notice that everything in 3D is just like all a state of mind. You know, things will come at you just to see how you're going to react to it, just to see how you're going to respond. Like God be testing us every five minutes, but the devil be doing it too. So it's just like, are you going to play this little mind game that they're going to play? Are you going to allow things that, you know, when, when you know you're being tested left and right? Like I told y'all the other day, I had financial issues. My daughter got sick. My grandbaby got sick. Um. My tire blew out. I just got my car out the shop, truck out the shop, and next thing you know, the other day my tire blew, and it just didn't just like have a little hole in it. I mean, it had a big hole, and next thing you know, the tread came off, and then you seeing all wires sticking out. Like my truck should have flipped over, but it didn't. It just you know just ricocheted all over the road, and thank God there was nobody there. And it's been like that for a while because I was wondering why my truck was shaking, and my daughter was like, "Mom, it might be the catalytic for converter or whatever it is." And I was like, "I don't think so," but then I didn't pay, didn't think, "Hey, you know the tire might be going out because this is like new tires, you know." So all of a sudden when I look, it was the newest tire I got, and it popped a hole in it. I was just like, "God, you know." That's crazy because even my ex was like, Rosalyn, this could have really did some damage to you and the truck. But thank God, because it's like I've been going back and forth on the highway and stuff like that. wondering why my truck was shaking so much. But then, it, you know, everything was fine after that. But it's just like, this is the things that's going to let you know you're on the 5D. You know, when you see things that's happening in 3D, you know, there are going to be people coming at you crazy. Or, you know, there's a negative state of mind. There might be some old things that... 
popping up out of your head like you went through like about four or five years ago. I'm like, where the hell did this come from? I wasn't even thinking about this because you're, re you know, you're, you're just recycling everything, filtering out. It's just like things are just letting go. And it's not even like you trying to go back in memory lane to try to torture yourself. These are things that you still have left over in the back of your psyche that you were trying to let free of. So these are the signs that you need to know that you are on your 5d you know you are elevating in so many different ways it's a beautiful thing to be able to feel this way because i'm just like i'm not on any kind of loosening i'm not on any kind of you know relaxation thing except my you know my my meditation music but yet i feel like i am like you very euphoric <laughs> i was like i don't know if it's just because i'm channeling my dad as well and they usually say that could be another you know sign of your twin flame is around because it's like you'll feel very euphoric like you're being drugged up because that could be it too because you know he's always supporting me and i always hear him after i do my videos he's like wow you just my blow me about how you speak to your family like that and i'm glad that he's proud of me because i always wonder like is my dad proud of me does he you know does he listen out for my videos and it's just certain things like uh, a song will come on or whatever and it'll be being able to validate that my dad was around because there'll be a certain song i have in my head next thing you know, i look at my phone and it's about to play on my playlist so i'm like wow thank you so i hope you're able to resonate with the content of this video much love to y'all let me see who i'm gonna get my shout out to um jonas cologne uh jason much love to you as well and cynthia much love to you and know that you are truly blessed highly favored and forever loved and knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days i pray for y'all each and every day and i love you from the bottom of my heart and thank you so much for the love and support i cannot you know emphasize that as much so much i can for the support that you you know you share my videos you're giving me a thumbs up you're dropping lines and i greatly appreciate it so know you are truly blessed highly favored and forever loved and like and subscribe even hit that notification bell send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can you never know when somebody truly needs it it's just the you know kind words can really go so far so i'll see you on my next video much love peace and be wild